hi guys i'm kenny welcome to or welcome back to my channel so yeah i really liked making the unpopular opinions video last time so i was like make one again so what are we doing we're gonna make one again so this one it gets a little y'all not gonna like some of these but my opinion so we're gonna we're gonna get straight into it but i might make one more because i really like these but comment down below some like if you want it to be like a topic like unpopular opinions fast food unpopular opinion shoes unpopular opinions blah 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 let me know because i really i really rock with this this is kind of fun so we're gonna start with number one decorating is the best part of the holidays so any holiday i really i don't care that much um christmas thanksgiving easter new year's whatever like decorating the house is the best part always or decorating a school or decorating your room anything like having the lights outside halloween and putting i got no at um michael's they have the the much they got the little the boards i don't know what they call but the boards and just having it around and that really gets me in the holiday mood like i don't really care for the holiday i care for them but you know what i'm saying decorating it just it really gets you in that holiday spirit so it don't get better than it don't get better than that i mean everything like food guests people i mean that's nice too however decorating okay so y'all gonna hate me apple and orange juice which one's better there's not a better one they're they're equal i feel like it really depends on what you want that time that point that moment if that makes sense so like in the morning i'm obviously want orange juice and then around like when lunch time or whatever i'm gonna want apple juice like i feel like it's not one's not better than the other it's the same it's just it's just juice let me tell you the cranberry juice is nasty but that's not a part of this that's off topic but if you want to know now you know number three love at first sight is not real four okay let me explain a little bit i got mine anyway love at first sight isn't real but for people like if i saw this random boy walking down the street and i was like oh my gosh i'm in love no that's not how that works however however you can get love at first sight with objects or animals like if i saw a dog at a pound or something and i was about to go buy a dog and i was like oh my gosh that is the one that's a love at first sight that's what i would consider a love at first sight but i feel like you can't be there's no love at first sight when it comes to people you have to get to know a person you have to because when you got love at first sight you're not looking at personality you just it's just it's just looks it's just that's it's not personality, it's not mentality, it's not, you don't know anything about the person, nothing at all. You just look at them and you like, that's the, how do you look at a person and you're like, I'm in love? That don't, and I'm not saying like you can't look at a celebrity and be like, I'm in love, but when you, when you have a celebrity crush, that's it. It's your, you don't know any, you don't, you, so, unless you're stalking them, but you don't know anything about the celebrity you only know what they show you so if that makes sense like you can't be love at first sight with nobody if you don't know the person you gotta really know the person to be in love with the person i think that's just my opinion this one some of y'all gonna leave my video but oh well dark skins dark skins are so mistreated especially the female so i'm gonna break it down i'm gonna break it down y'all gonna be like she brown skin she don't get to talk about this but i don't i'm letting y'all know dark skins are so mistreated for the boys when they're younger i feel like 
when they're younger, they get mistreated the most. Like everyone's like, ew, no, 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 whatever. Cause they just get mistreated. But as they get older, people start to be like, ooh, ooh, he's cute. You see what I'm saying? But females, y'all, don't mistreat them so bad for no reason. They're they're good girls. They're so cute. <sighs> I feel about this one because I just don't understand. Females get it from when they're kid all the way to when they're grown and to when they die. That's how I feel. That, that's not even how, that's what I know. It's my opinion. Some people might think that their skins get treated perfectly fine. However, they're mistreated completely. So if you already left the video, bye. The next one is putting a title on a bond messes up the bond. In my opinion. So if I have a little friend or whatever and we just friends. And then suddenly he or she's like, yo, we should be best friends. Like that should that messes up everything. And same with like relationships. Like if I rock with somebody and they like, oh let's date. No, it messes up the vibe, in my opinion. Because when you put title on things, it's just like and let's I don't know how to break it down for y'all how I feel, but sometimes it's okay. But I feel like just sometimes it's just like, why did we, putting titles on things makes you feel like you have to act a certain way, in my opinion, in my opinion. Like when you think of a boyfriend or a girlfriend, you think they're gonna feel like they have to do something as a boyfriend or a girlfriend compared or if you think of a best friend they feel like they have to act as a best friend compared to whatever you guys were acting like before i just feel like you don't need to rush into titles or anything and that goes for friend wise that goes for calling somebody your family that goes whatever 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 that's just my opinion though i think y'all might agree with that one so let me let me know what y'all think about that one because next Twitter goes crazy. Period. So I feel if you don't if you don't use Twitter, like if you don't know how to use Twitter, it's not gonna go crazy. But if you follow the right people, if you know the right people, if you post the right stuff, Twitter goes crazy. And also, if you look into it, so at least on my feed, I don't know about y'all's feed, but I use Pinterest, I use Instagram. Go watch my what's on my iPhone video, link in the description box down below. But I use all that kind of stuff. So a lot of stuff on Instagram and Pinterest is stuff off my Twitter, like it's Twitter tweets. So obviously there's something on Twitter that y'all not seeing. I think Twitter is the way to go. I like all of them. However, I people will be trying to cancel Twitter, but don't cancel her. We y'all need her. Eggs. Okay. Red tattoos. I'll put some pictures in case you don't know what I'm talking about. I don't want any tattoos. However, I think that red tattoos look bomb. So let me. They're just so. They're different. They're really different. And not a lot of people have red tattoos. But I've heard that they tend to fade easily and that kind of stuff. Which makes sense because it's a colored tattoo. But they're just so pretty. They're so pretty. I like them, but I'm not getting one. But I never wanted tattoos. But I just think they're really nice. And it's something different. It's a little different. It's a little different. So red tattoos are the way to go, in my opinion. This is the last one, yo. <sighs> Y'all gonna say I'm so boring. I don't care about them. So... Ferris, like amusement parks and like fairs, fairs, fair, fair, F A I R, fair. So me, I feel like the rides there, no. So roller coasters, Ferris wheels, the little things that go up and drop. Um, what else is there? Little things that just spin you around. Anything that you are not on the ground is a no-go for me. Absolutely not. 
Uh-uh. God put me on the ground, so I'm gonna stay on the ground. I do not know why people ride roller coasters, ride the little zoo. No, uh, no. <laughs> I don't know what is going on. Ha. They just, uh, I'm, all my friends, most of my friends ride roller coasters and do all that. And they go to the amusement parks all the time. And of course they want me to go, so I go. But I don't ride anything. If anything, I just go to the park and spend my money. I buy food. I buy little little teddy bears. I just rides are not for me. However, I did mention this in my list, but Ferris wheels are okay for the most part. They're okay. I wouldn't. It's not like an everyday kind of thing for me. I've only been on one, and it wasn't even big. It was in Six Flags, New Jersey, I think. So I liked it, but would I go again? Maybe not, but maybe. So, but roller coasters are a definite no for me. I'm not getting on a roller coaster. If it was die or get on the roller coaster, I might just die. Um, it's a no go. So yeah, that's my final opinion. And it's gonna stay like that so thank you so much for watching my video more videos will be in the description box down below don't forget to follow me on all my social medias also in the description box down below um i love kenny if you didn't know and comment more video ideas you want to see and comments if you want another unpopular opinions but with a topic not all over the place a topic graph food celebrity that might be it. Let me know. Let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.